Yellow Subterfuge is the seventh episode of the 25th season of The Simpsons, directed by Bob Anderson. And in this one, there's going to be a school trip in a submarine, but obviously only so many students can fit inside the submarine. So Skinner has decided to let power go to his head. And basically every child has a clean slate, but as soon as any child does anything wrong, their name is wiped off of the list and they're not allowed on the submarine. Bart is desperate to go on this submarine so he takes advantage of his clean slate and behaves impeccably but will he actually get to go on the submarine i can't talk too much more about that without giving a spoiler warning so i'll do that in a moment but i will say it was quite it was quite an interesting narrative skinner was really annoying and normally i love skinner i was kind of i loved to be annoyed by him in this episode i enjoyed watching the performance of the character but i hated the character in this and that basically never happens normally i'm usually on skinner's side so it was definitely quite a different experience and i think it worked quite well it was of course nice to see bart behaving for something and it goes to show that as long as a child can find something they care about it can actually help to drive their behavior in a positive way and it shows that positive behaviors can be rewarded but of course whether or not bart's positive behavior is rewarded remains to be seen I really enjoyed that part of it. We also have a subplot involving Krusty, who, with Lisa's prompting, licenses out the Krusty name to other countries. And we see what I have to admit are quite awkward, very stereotypical foreign Krusties, as it were. And yeah, I mean, there was a weird itchy and scratchy that was definitely full of stereotypes and I think maybe it went a little bit too far. I wasn't personally offended by anything because they weren't stereotyping me but if somebody watched this and was offended by the stereotypes I'd understand. I didn't mind it too much but even you know a tiny part of me did think this feels a little uncomfortable so I can understand if somebody really didn't like it. There was also a Spongebob parody which uh, worked quite well. So, spoilers from now, I'm going to go into a bit of detail about ultimately what happened with Bart and then what Bart and Homer did. So, big, big spoilers from this point on. I was quite surprised and really angered, really, really angered when Skinner decided to wipe Bart's name off of the list because there's nothing worse than seeing a child, particularly a child who's usually really quite naughty, behaving really well and then for them to not actually get the, the the reward because it kind of reinforces the the thought that that child has that you might as well just behave or misbehave because what difference does it make and this is what we see with Bart so it really annoyed me but ultimately what Homer and Bart do with Mrs Skinner um I thought it was interesting and I, I wasn't sure where it would go and, and kind of what Skinner would find out so while I actually wish that Bart did get to go on the submarine, it did open up uh, a different path for the narrative that I found to be quite enjoyable. And it served Skinner right, let's face it. So in all, it was a really good episode. The crusty bits, maybe a little bit awkward. Skinner's behaviour did annoy me, but in a way that I found to be um, ultimately quite entertaining. It's not my favourite episode of all time. But actually, it's not too bad and I'd be quite happy to watch Yellow Subterfuge again.